How did it feel to step out there, and, and what did you think of the competition? Yeah, I thought it felt good. Um, first two games have been high pace. Um, you know, I think it's just, you know, getting your legs under you, feeling the pace of play, getting back into it. Um, it's been good. I think tonight um, tonight was a wake-up call, just to keep it simple. Um, you know, and just the pace of play has got to pick up for us. But uh, I think, honestly, it's good to get back out there, and um, we'll see how it goes from here. How do you assess your own, your own game during a, a game like that, or can you do that as quickly as just a few minutes after it? I mean, I don't necessarily think it's about my own game. You can obviously, uh, you can obviously pick out your own game and, and you know make sure your work ethic is there, make sure you're making the right plays, you know, watching your turnovers. But I think right now, with you know just being the second game in a new environment, I think it's just all about you know working hard, keeping it simple, and just you know doing the little things right right now. You're a Michigan guy, I think I, I saw a couple of Ellis jerseys. Is that yeah. like which family members are in attendance here? Yeah, my uh, my parents and my grandparents are here, and then um, I live about uh, 30 minutes uh, south of here. So I had a couple uh, of the family friends that were that were in town that just made the drive. Um, a lot of them are new to hockey, so it was cool uh, cool to see them here. Well, what chemist, how does it help when you have someone like Alex Steves here with the chemistry that you guys can establish? Kind of when you had to be thrust into the four or four situation, or some of the shifts when you're kind of playing together that you can kind of yeah. feed off each other. I think it's great. Um, Alex is a super helpful guy. You know, he's uh, he's welcoming. You know, he takes it upon himself just to, to help some of the younger guys, which is great. I mean, uh, I think I think even in the the shift today, like he just patted me on the back. You know, told me like let's get it going here, and and you know, it's just simple things like that that help you because you you feel comfortable playing with a guy that you know how he plays, and I think the style that he plays um, is easy to connect with. So it's it's a big help. Has he been kind of that kind of leadership type guy when he was at Notre Dame as well? Yeah, for sure. I mean, he's always been a type of guy to, you know, stand up. He's always been super serious about his business and, uh, and the way he handles himself. It's something to look up to. So I think uh, being able to look up to a guy like that and see what he did in his first year and then, you know, learning from him on my time in my first year is, is going to be super valuable for me. Could you just elaborate a little bit more about having that support system here to kind of ease you into the season? Do you feel it makes it easier or is it maybe a little bit nerve wracking because you are performing in front of people that you're so close to? I mean, I, th I think it's both. Um, it's obviously never easy to jump into an environment like this. Um, you know, but people like that make it easier. They help you. Um, and I think it's just like uh, the message has been repeated. Just keep it simple, work hard, and, uh, you know, don't do too much. And I think, um, you know, having people like that around to reiterate the message and, you know, help you feel comfortable definitely eases the transition a little bit.